Oh hi guys, this is Sunny Flair and Sui Pro my fan to that's every. In this video, I'm going to talk about my laptop, which I got it back in Christmas of 2016 along the way. And this is a question. This is a HP Pavan DV9000 laptop. So this is a laptop that was released during the Windows XP and Windows Vista days. So I'm going to show you this laptop. Over here, we got the keyboard. The touch buttons, which is the coolest thing on the laptop, and we have volume, mute, stop, previous, uh, next chapter, playing pause, previous chapter, DVD, which doesn't do anything, and the replay button, which is also doesn't do anything, and a power button, a QRT keyboard, which is very nice in my hands, a mouse, which is actually a touch, and the lock mouse button. Let me show you. If I press this button, the mouse didn't move. If I press this button, the mouse cursor move and we have the sticker about the quick play five wire car reader and the remote control that's included we have the intestine trio dual processor a new diva geforce go 7 600 and the light scrap direct laser labeling and the design for Windows XP Windows Vista compatible. Even though it's running Windows 10, this computer was originally released during Windows XP and Windows Vista lifespan so over here we got the S video port VGA expansion port free two 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 phone port HDMI which is kind of cool so you can connect to a HD TV or something like that two USB ports uh a porch which I don't know but maybe this is a firewire port and a five in one card with for HD and then MS Pro, MMC card, MSC, and XD card. So we have the button so it can open up the screen. And then we have three 3.5 milliliter ports for line, line out and microphone. And I have an infrared safe sensor for the remote. So in this other side, we have the charging port. The battery discharges quickly, so I have to put this. This charger before filming this video, we have the one extra USB port, a disk drive, which I will show you. As you can see, and we have the remote control. This is one of the coolest things in the laptop, but I will show you in a few minutes. And we have the another extra USB port. So this computer was this computer is running Windows 10, even though it says. It was released during Windows XP and Windows Vista day, so it's possible to install Windows 10 on a Windows XP and Windows Vista area PC. Let me show you the system properties. So, in here we have, we're running Windows 10 Education, even though this is a version of Windows that was designed for schools. And let me show you, this is the properties. So this is Windows 10 Education, a version of Windows 10 design for schools. We have the Intel Core 2 CPU, and the CPU number is T5600, 1.5 gigahertz. 2 gigs of RAM, 32-bit operating system, even though it has a 64-bit processor, which will also run Windows those 10 64-bit version, and all other 64-bit version of Windows, and Windows was ac activated. So let me close this. So I remember when I used to have, so I'm going to show you my past laptops during my life. So I remember when I used to have this Acer laptop, which has broken. It's uploaded, this video about this broken laptop was uploaded in my Alora account, which is Iskeria. This is a broken laptop that I have. So, so I remember when this laptop have a screen. Here's a component of this laptop which actually broke the screen was bad the battery cover was good the charging port was good the ram is good which i lost it and the disk drive and the hard drive are good but i broke both of it which are a hard drive and the disk drive which is also a dvd drive and also the charging the charging the charging cable was good the ram is good the screen is bad the hard drive is good even though I broke it and the disc and the DVD drive was good but I also broke it and missing is best so so and I also remember when I had a HP Pavan G7 laptop which had an Intel Petium processor so this is the laptop that I used to have so watch this video this is Dorian friends into the city and Wings Club Hater to that
Hi, this is Dorian Friends, and today is a week's Club Hate to 2003. And yes, we are going to talk about my review on the Path on G7. So, so I buy this laptop today, I'm going to talk about my laptop. So, anyway, here is the nails. This is a touchpad. I remember when I used this laptop during when I age evident. I'm going to show you. So, I used to have this laptop while I age evaded. So the only parts of this broken Acer laptop that I had during when I even used it was a charger and the battery. I'll pause this video where which I can find it. I'll pause this video when I find these two remaining components of that laptop. All right, guys. I will sit sit here and wait until I find my battery and my charger. All right, guys. Sit here. Wait. All right, guys. I found it. So I'm going to show. As you can see, this is my remaining parts of my old Acer laptop, which my dad broke it because I made his computer run slow. If my dad watches my computer running slow, he gets mad and he destroyed the laptop. And the only punishment that my dad gave me while he's breaking my laptop was spankings. He he broke the laptop while he spanks me. I'll show you the co remaining components I have for that laptop. Here's the two surviving components I have half. So this is the battery that was came with this laptop. It was in remarkable good condition. It's in good condition and then I can feel it in my hand. It looks like new. And we have the charger. So this charger, I'm gonna show you the end of the port. And actually it's very different to this other charger that I have. So here I'm gonna show you the back of the it was and one of the generic batteries will, will work with my laptop. This is one of the generic battery uh, charger. It's used to charge a laptop, which I want to use it. So over here we have the a lot of right laptop. This is for parts for repair. It had no screen. So the model number of this laptop was the was nine was uh, was nine seven. 700. So this is a model on laptop. This is DV9 700. So this is for parts and repair when this laptop was broke. And this is the screen. This screen has a white line. It had a problem with this like white line. So this computer was also released during Windows Vista days, but it had an AMD Fusion X2 processor and also an NVIDIA processor. Both of these laptops are Wi Fi. So they're both actually identical, but the only difference of this laptop, and you will see, I'm going to show you. Let me show you it. Let me pause this video. Yeah, and this is a keyboard that I had from this other laptop, which is for part of repair for this laptop. And on the top we have this, this, keyboard from that laptop. So one difference is this is a extra keyboard and this is a curate keyboard. And the enter button are look different. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Alright guys. So the touch pad which is looks the same. They both look the same. One of the coolest things of that laptop was over here. Let me pause. Alright guys this is the remote control that was came of this laptop. So, this is very cool. This one does not work. I have to replace the battery on this. Let me show you the battery. Let me pause this video. It uses this large bunny cell battery, which I have to get one of these to, to, re to replace. So, let me put it back. So, let me show you the bottom of this laptop. So, I'll pause this video, and I'm going to go in the bottom of the laptop. Alright, guys, wait. Alright, guys, I show you the bottom of this laptop. So, I have to put this t-shirt in the bottom of the side because I don't want to get this laptop scratch. So, according to here, this computer was originally had Windows XP Media Center Edition 2005 HP OEM copy install. This, this computer was originally used to have OEM copy of Windows XP Media Center Edition 2005, which is an OEM copy. Which is an OEM, HP OEM copy of this operating system. It was originally used to have Windows XP Media Center Edition 2005 HP OEM. So we have a battery. I'll pause this video so I could not waste it with the laptop. I'll pause this video.
all right guys so i removed the battery and i go to show you so on the bottom this is the battery that i had for the broken laptop which is the acer spire this is a battery from the laptop which my dad broke me which is an acer spire laptop in the top we have the battery for this laptop that i had it did today so this is the battery from the laptop so over here the model number was hp pavan d v night that awesome well, over here, this is the back of my parts and repair laptop. So I have the, so my dad had the hard drive removed, the RAM removed, and this thing for the Wi-Fi. I'm going to show. This is a thing for the Wi-Fi. So which is also removed. So this is the place when when the when the hard drive was used to be. There's two ports on the laptop. One over here and another over here. This is the two ports for the hard drive, and this is the battery cover. So you can see it, but I don't know what is over here, but Maybe this computer originally had Windows Vista Home Preview OEM, HP OEM copy of Windows Vista Home Preview. So maybe it was over here. Maybe it was originally had and used to have this operating system. So here's a product key. So the product key that you cannot see. And I upload the hard, high quality version of this product key. So if your product key for this this Windows XP Media Center Edition 2005 was lost, I will upload the high quality version of this product key on my Umberto 2000 David R page. And so that does that, that or so does this laptop. So here's a model number of this parts and repair HP laptop. It was HP Pavin DV9700. So this is a laptop for parts and repair. So they both look identical. They both look identical except for this one. It was very rich out and this one, no, it was stuck in here. They both look identical for no reason. All right guys, this is my review video on this HP Pavilion DV 9000 laptop. All right guys, bye.